now to our AFCON 2023 finals, Nigeria against Cote d'Ivoire. We'll start off with the M Managing Director of S Lobos Nigeria Company in River State in Nigeria, a football follower by excellence, and of course, an academic scholar, Dr. Sylvester Ekudu. Good evening to AFCON Live Update. Good evening. So, um, let's take a look at the Nigeria Cote d'Ivoire match coming up on Sunday. What's your prediction and what do you look out for? Well, I want to start still passing the euphoria of our hard earned victory over the South African. Congratulations to Nigeria, congratulations to Everybody, congratulations to the Super Eagles. I call them the Super Duper Superlative Super Eagles. Uh, coming from uh, that match to the final of the finals on Sunday with Cote d'Ivoire, for me, it's just like uh, someone who's counted the 100 and now we want to come and count 88. For me, it's going to be a walk The second question is on Victor Simen, the reign African Player of the Year. Yeah. He's from Odo State in Nigeria and from your state. Um, what can we pick out from Victor Simen's performance so far in the AFCON and what lessons can we learn from him in life? All right. Um, I'll start by saying this. That successful people are ordinary people with extraordinary determination to succeed. That little extra. That little extra is what makes the difference between a successful person and an unsuccessful person. Therefore, Victor Seaman, which uh, who you know his uh, background very well, probably from that very humble background, uh, hawking water and stuff in Lagos, rising to that level what you can call from street to start on today, uh, was a man, was a shared determination, days of hard work. He got committed to the fact that, yes, he will not have said being in this condition that he met, he found himself. And he discovered the potential in, in him and unleashed it. Today is Victor Seaman. In Napoli, Victor Seaman, everywhere has become a, a song on every lips. So, um, it just to let everybody know that you can become anybody only if you are committed to your cause, only if you are determined, if you are ready to show uh, that innate desire to unleash that potential in you. So, that's a statement for you. Okay, the final question is, um, what does Nigeria's win nation scope? What does it bring to the economy? You're a businessman, you run a slow business group of companies. What does it bring to Nigeria? What does it bring to companies? All right. Nigeria is not uh, the host nation. Take that, put it in your pocket first. But if you look at um, the participation first, before the winning, all of the bonuses that the Super Eagles have earned from the group stages up to now that they've made it to the finals are going into their bank account. And those bank accounts are domiciled in Nigeria. And that's going to increase the cash flow in banks. But again, look at it from this angle. Other benefits to Nigeria economy, Nigeria GDP, is the fact that the from Vito Seaman to all other wonderful great guys who will be making us proud, normally over 24 persons, all of these people would have uh, become the responsibility of the government to begin to take over to provide jobs for them. Another question I would like to ask you is that will this bring about brand endorsement? You're a businessman. Will you go for Victor Simon for your brand ambassador? 
They are shocked. Sure, but the people of Zimia is a message to the youth. You can take it to the bank. Because the of Zimia unleashed the potential in him, like I said earlier. And that is what the youth should embrace. That you can actually convert the very harsh, very hostile potential in you that energy into something beneficial. Also, we don't have time to go and steal. Out of him, he has made out the wealth he needs, and he will spread it to others. So, sure, the happy of Simon as a brand name on the B boards <laughs> would be wonderful. It was Simon has become a message. It's been nice talking with now. Dr. Sylvester Ekudu, congratulations and we say thank you very much for speaking with our AFCON live update. You can watch this live, not just on RSTV, also on NCA tomorrow, hopefully before the AFCON finals. I do, I wish I survived you all the best at the final against Kudu Guam Sunday. Do it again, do it better, keep this call and bring it back to Nigeria. Thank you.